Hi, welcome to Rehab Through Recipes. My name is Mari, and today we're gonna to be working on a delicious vegetable quiche. The nice thing about a quiche is that they are easy to make and that they will hold in the refrigerator for up to a week without spoiling. So for you folks that are busy and on the go, this is a great way to make sure that you have a nutritious, delicious breakfast. So let's get started with the pie crust. In this bowl, I have one cup of all-purpose flour. To that, I am going to add two tablespoons of butter. And we're gonna mix those in, smash it up. And we want to incorporate and granulate the butter with the flour. You want to try and break the crumbs apart. To that, I am going to add a quarter cup of cold water, filtered or bottled water, preferably. And so now we're going to mix this, mix this in together. Add a dash of salt. And then we're going to form this into a ball. Now that I can't mix it any further. Mix it into a ball. And this will have to be refrigerated for about an hour or two because you want it to get nice and cold so it'll give you a nice flaky crust. So I have already prepared one ahead of time that we're going to roll out now. So let me put this away and grab the other one. So here is my chilled dough. Doesn't look like much, but a nice chilled dough. And I'm gonna put a little bit of flour. And then on top of that, I'm gonna put the plastic and we're gonna roll it out. So we time-lapsed this a little bit because how boring is it to watch somebody roll out dough, right? So now we're gonna take our rolled out dough and put it into a pie plate that has already been sprayed. We're gonna dump it right in, push it down, and make little decorations right here or cut some off and put it on the top. I like to put it on the top a little bit. So I'm just gonna snip it and all the way around. And now we're gonna get ready for the good stuff. The pie. Okay, so moving on to the delicious filling. Here I have mushrooms, zucchini, onion, garlic, and spinach. So I'm gonna drop that into the bottom of the pie plate. And we're gonna set that aside for a moment. In the bowl, two eggs with one uh, green onion cut up. Let me wash my hands. And that we're gonna mix. I, uh, as far as the vegetables, you can use any vegetables you want as long as it's about 12 ounces. So uh, you don't have to follow the vegetables that I've used. I've even used uh, vegetables that were left over from throughout the last couple of days. I'll just, 12 ounces, throw it into the pie crust. So to the two eggs, we're gonna add half a cup of milk and one, table, one half of a tablespoon of flour. we're gonna mix that well again I use almond milk non uh, unsweetened I prefer it it's lower in calorie also so for those of us that are watching our girly figures we can drink a little extra milk without having to worry about our, our weight so now I'm gonna drop the egg into my mixture. 
to that, I am going to add a, uh, two ounces of shredded, che shredded cheese, whether cheddar, mo Monterey Jack, whatever you like. So we'll dump that. And on top of that, who doesn't love a delicious tomato? So I'm gonna slice the tomato. Set it right on top. Now with the rest of the pie crusts, we can make some pretty designs and put it in between the tomato to have extra crust. And there you have it. And now I'm gonna put it in the refri and really in the refrigerator. Now I'm gonna put it in the oven for 45 minutes. We're gonna bake it for 40 minutes at 325. Then we're gonna put it up to 355 for 10 minutes. So I'll see you when we come back. Hi, so 50 minutes have gone by and we had this at 325 for 40 minutes and then we increased the temperature to 355 for 10 minutes and this is a beautiful quiche that you end up with. Just in case I didn't mention it earlier, make sure that you cook your vegetables first, drain them so that your quiche is not running. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe. I'll catch you on the next episode. Thanks for watching We Have Few Recipes.